Hi Barry, this is Stephanie. So in this video, I'm going to pretty much show your website next to the top two competitors in your area. I'm going to show the front end and also the back end and kind of just tell you what needs to be done in order to uh, become the number one person in your area for civil law. So uh, content is the first thing I want to talk you talk to you about. Google likes to see at least 1500 words of keyword rich content on your homepage. And we see that you guys only have a couple hundred words. So we definitely want to get more content added to your homepage. And also, uh, when Google's crawling the pages, they don't actually see images. So they read what's behind them. So when we save image as, we can see that this is saved as worker with some numbers. So you definitely want to get all the photos saved as keywords. Checking out your top competitor, Mather Law. Uh, we see that they have an okay amount of content. They probably have seven to 800 words on their homepage. Um, that's very beatable. And then uh, the Ashmore Law Firm, they don't have a whole lot going on. Um, so that's also very beatable. The next thing I wanna to talk to you about are citations. So when we look up civil attorneys, Dallas TX, the first thing at the top is gonna to be the map pack and below that is the organic section. So citations come to play in the map pack and a citation is just your business name, address, and phone number listed in different directories throughout the internet, such as Yelp, white pages, even Facebook has a spot for a directory. So the tool that I like to use to see how many citations each person has is called whitespark.ca. We see that uh, MR Civil Justice has 20 citations, Donald has 75, and you guys have 15. So um, you definitely, I would suggest adding two to 300 citations so you can beat your competition by a landslide. The last thing I wanna to talk to you about are backlinks and that is how you're gonna rank in the organic section. So we're gonna go ahead and skip past the first two directories and just go straight to the first guy, which is Math or Law. Um, so just to explain a backlink to you, uh, backlinks are also known as link juice. And link juice simply put works like this. So site A is going to point to site B. Therefore, site A is acting like the link juice, giving site B more authority in Google's eyes. So it's almost like a popularity contest. Um, there's a little bit more to it than that though. Uh, so the link juice you obtain works a lot more effective if you have relative sites linking back to your website. So say you had a lawyer in California linking back to your website, that's gonna be a lot more effective than say Pizza Hut because Google knows that you guys are not in the pizza industry. So you definitely wanna make sure that you're getting relative trustworthy sites pointing back to you. So the tool I like to use for that is called Ahrefs. And so uh, Mather Law here, they're actually in the number one position for a back page. That's not even their home page. So you really just have to beat out their back page. Um, and they only have six referring domains with 11 backlinks coming in. So that's super beatable. Uh, same thing with Ashmore. This is also a back page for them. So if we can push enough power to your homepage, you can just outrank both of them. Um, they don't have any referring domains or backlinks. So plug you guys in right here. We see that you have three refer, or, I'm sorry, seven referring domains giving you 35 backlinks. Um, but you guys are only being found for three keywords, which would be, you know, your names. So Karen and Brian, but even for your own names, you're in the 32nd position uh, for Brian and the 13th position on Google for Karen. So just to take a look at the volume uh, of searches every month, just to kind of give you an idea, uh, we have, Civil Attorney Dallas TX, there's roughly 150 searches every month for that keyword. Uh, KD is keyword difficulty, so it's fairly easy to rank. CPC is the cost per click, so if you were to pay for any Google ads, uh, anytime anyone clicked on the ad, it would be $13. And position is going to be the position that this person sits in for that keyword. So uh, they are in the sixth position for Civil Attorneys Dallas TX. So that's 150 civil suit attorney Dallas TX. There's another 70 um, civil attorneys 
Dallas or Civil Attorney Dallas, there's another 70. Civil Attorney Dallas, Texas, another 60. Uh, Civil Lawyers in Dallas TX, 90. Dallas Civil Lawyers, another 70. So you can see there's a few hundred searches every month for civil uh, lawyers in your area. And we can see that, you know, you're also not being found for those searches at all. So it's a lot of business you're missing out on. Uh, uh, that, just to do a recap for you, you want to do 1,500 words or more of keyword-rich content on your home page. Uh, also, get your photos saved as keywords. Go ahead and add two to 300 citations to your Google My Business listing. And of course, you want to add a keyword rich description along with um, optimized photos and just make sure everything is to Google's liking in there. And then you want to go ahead and get relative trustworthy backlinks pointing back to your website. So that way you can rank in the organic section. Uh, that's all I have for you. If you have any questions, feel free to reach back out to me. Uh, thanks so much for taking the time to watch this video, and I hope you'll have a great one.